So I'm doing a photo shoot right now. What do I use to get ready for my own photo shoot and what would I use? Starting with the Good Jeans Sunday Riley and the Sunday Riley Vitamin C Cream Plus and the Sunday Riley Afterglow. So none of this is affiliation of anything. This is just what I wear, what I trust, and what I know will be good in my photo shoot. So let's go. Then some Pixi Depuffing Eye Mask. I'm doing a little L'Oreal Infallible concealer on my lids and latte. I can't. My favorite just me palette is the Patrick Tom Major Dimensions 2. I've had this. It will last forever. And they're just great colors. So I'm going to start with the cream. If you didn't know, that cream in there, if you start with that and then do the shadow over it, it will grab to it. Then I'm, then I'm blend these two together. Just boom, boom. Go right over it. So it really locks in and doesn't move. What music plays in your head as you get ready? Mine is Shorty Had Them Apple Bottom Jeans. Boots with the fur, with the fur. Okay. Then I'm going to take this tone right here over the river and through the hood. Fluffier brush. Just ease your blending. This is BK. I'll tell you the number in a second. I love the BK brushes. If you don't have those, they're like reasonably priced, but really, really freaking good. Like, you see this lid looks heavy and swollen. This one, no. Then I'm just going to take like the shimmer colors and just kind of slop them together. I don't really care. And just go right on the lid for a little pop. Don't mean a thing if it ain't got that wing. That's my trademark. Okay, so I'm doing... A Sisley Cushion Foundation. This is expensive. It's like a hundred something, but it makes my skin luminous and glow. This is Sisley Cushion, and if I do it under, my skin will stay radiant all day. It makes my skin look like I'm 12. Then I'm going to do the House Labs Foundation in 220. And I just kind of like smush it in, just pressing, not pulling because I want coverage. So I press, press, press is best. The Mario Contour, Makeup by Mario in shade Medium Dark because I want it to really stay and pop. And I'll buff it out. Then the L'Oreal Infallible, okay, using shade Latte to go under the eyes and to make a cheekbone sharp enough to kill a man. What? Cheek rare beauty worth, because that shit don't play. I'm going to set my concealer with some of the Westman Atelier Translucent. I usually use the pink, but I think I put it in my bag and I can't find it right now. So that'll do. Can't be with the one you love, love the one you're with. And this new Twist and Light by Makeup Forever is my new fave. Have I told you lately that I love you? Then I'm going back in real quick with some House Labs Powder Bronze in shade 6. Just to warm up the situation and lock it in. I don't always do powder bronzer, but this is the one I like if I do. This Westman Atelier highlighter is bomb. I just break it out when I need it because I don't want to waste it. It's expensive. Milani 10 out of 10. Stay put. And then the House Labs Pomelo Peach. I freaking love this. Okay, look at that. L'Oreal Primer and Telescopic Lift. I don't really do expensive mascaras. I just don't see a need for it. These are great. Them apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur, with the fur.